Hey everyone, this is HostExaminer.com. I'm going to be talking real quick about choosing a web host, a professional paid web host to host your website on so you can have your own email addresses, uh, professional you know, domain and professional looking website and custom themes and whatever else you want to do with your website. So first of all, real quick, I want to talk about free um, web hosts. There's a lot of free website builders out there like, uh, for instance, WordPress.com actually. If you go to WordPress.com, you can have your own free website, but you, because it's not your own host, you can't upload themes, you can't upload plugins, you can't have your own email addresses, so you need a host for that. And um, otherwise, you're going to have a very basic theme like this. This is an example of one of their free themes. So you really wouldn't want a website as basic and ugly looking as this for the theme, which is what you would get with a free WordPress website. Uh, website. It's kind of like Blogspot. You know, it's it's your domain dot blogspot dot com. It's not customizable. You can't really do anything professional with it. It doesn't look good. Other things like I used to use ucause dot com, but what would happen is you don't get your own domain. It would be like hostexaminer dot ucause dot com. You also um, it was very limited. You know, you don't have your own email uh, control panel and all that. And, um, so anyways, as far as some of the hosts, it's definitely worthwhile. You can pay like 50 bucks a year or you can do pay monthly. The number ones, the ones I would recommend personally, um, I actually have them listed here at the top. Highest rated HostGator. So uh, if you're not too much on a budget, and it's not that expensive uh, actually, if you're not too much on a budget, HostGator is my number one recommendation. Uh, but the cheapest would be iPage. iPage you can get for like depending on the time of the year and the sale you can get like 45 bucks per year to 55 bucks per year and you get a free domain name at most probably 55 per year but usually they have some type of sale where it's in the 40s so you know that's pretty cheap that's only like um you know 45 bucks a year not that much you get a full year before you have to worry about paying and you get your own email addresses it's very professional looking you can host unlimited domains upload custom themes the emails is one of my favorite features you know having your own email like uh, uh, you know Bob at hostexaminer.com you can set up your, any email you want put it on your business card um, some other very popular hosts Bluehost is very popular it's well known I've also heard lots of good things about uh, InMotion. InMotion has a lot of good ratings, so does Arvikes. Um, really what it comes down to is not the host uh, reviews or ratings or quality. It's really the pricing. All that really com it comes down to is the pricing and customer service. If you need a lot of technical help, you probably want to go with someone with good customer service like HostGator. Um, otherwise, if you can get most of it by yourself um, and, and you're okay with decent customer service, you really should just base it on price because pretty much all web hosts have the same features. 99% uptime, unlimited domains, unlimited emails, free domain, anytime money back guarantee, unlimited space. It's the same features. So it's really it really just comes down to price and whichever one you happen to sign up for. Um, they're all very similar as you can see here. These are all $4.95, $5.95, $2.95. Four ninety five. Let's click show detailed pricing mode. So um, yeah, it really just based on your prices, the free feature, free bonuses like a free domain name, and that's what it comes down to. But as far as my recommendations, these would be the three: Fat Cow, iPage, and HostGator. Um, yeah, if you have any other questions, you can use HostExaminer.com. Um, use our contact form or uh, comment on this video. And thanks for watching.